Uh, we are in court. Uh, Only 16, 16. We are in court to process an uh, interim order we got against the Minister of uh, Niger Data Affairs and the management committee, interim management committee of NDDC. Where a client has approached the federal court, asking, among others, for an order for the leave to grant us the leave for judicial review of the appointment of the interim committee, which, in our own opinion, run foul to the law established in DDC. But the court, in its wisdom, has granted an order, even restricting the management team from performing the functions of the board of NDDC pending the determination of a motion of notice. And uh, we have been processing the order. We've got the order. As you can see it here, we have the order of the court. And this order has been affected to all the people that are affected. We have also written to the president, informing the president of this order, the attorney general, which is the, who is the chief law officer of the federation, also to comply with this order. And also to the director general of uh, DSS, the inspector general of police, informing them of this restraining order against the interim management board of NDDC. That any function, any function they perform in disregard to this court order will not stand because in clear terms, the court has restrained them from performing any function, signing any document, even assessing, signing any document in that capacity as members of the board. And that's why we say it is necessary for us to also bring to the public domain. We have served them, as you can see. We have copies of our letters. We have served the presidency. We have served the NDDC. We have served the Attorney General, Inspector General of Police, and the Secretary to the Government of the Federation. And we want, or we advise, that in obedience, Nigeria being a democracy, uh, run a democracy, we advise that they should obey this order by refrain, refraining from signing or performing any function of NDDC. We also, in our letter, inform the president to appoint the most senior civil servants to take the position or to take the duty and the management of NDDC, pending the determination of the motion on notice, presently pending before the federal court, or the constitution of the proper board in line with the law. That's why. Yeah, on what grounds did you come to court to get this order? We have two grounds. One, we are questioning the powers of the president to even constitute the interim management committee because in NDDC Act, there's no provision that accommodates interim management committee. The law is very clear on who and who and the modernity and the procedure for constitution of the uh, board of NDDC. That is one of the things we are challenging before the court. And the court has granted us leave, having seen the facts and the law.